have a package waiting on me, apparently. I know what it is. I have a couple of, they got a few nephews with birthdays in March. One of them's not technically in March, but basically I got three male birthdays in March to handle. One of whom is grown. I'm not sure what to get amateur adults for their birthdays anymore. Now the young people in my life are above average, but in general, I know that likes and follows are commodity. So I'll keep that in mind when purchasing gifts for, for amateur adults outside of my family circle. But I don't know how to package likes and follows. How you wrap that up? How you put that in a box? How you mail that? I don't even understand the value system. How am I be able? To, how am I know how to get on over here? Cause you gonna play? I see you gonna see right now. You wanna play games? And I don't have time. Accent. I was expecting it to be a Kia. No shade to Kia drivers. But I'd rather you drive like that than drive like BMW drivers. Who they drive with such aggr assert aggressive privilege? You're not just the actually privileged ones either. I think BMW. I think when colored folk get themselves a BMW, they they think they're disguised with privilege somehow at, on the road. They still see that you black girl. They still see that you black. And by girl, I mean all genders who drive BMWs because they've been driving like bitches. Woohoo! Woo! I drove through both of them rigs like a boss. Ooh, I got sandwiched. Don't none of y'all come over here. Oh man, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 12. I'm such a badass. Man, fuck Farnco. Fuck them. And you know what else? It seems like since there have been some states to, to, become, to, to become legal, you would hear a whole lot more about a whole lot more people being shit healed, fucking cured from their ailments. Not just treated, bitch. Cured. Healed and cured. Like brand freaking new, yo. But nah, we don't, not a peep, not a peep about what it has done for some people. For a lot of people. We're up in the 90s percentile of people who need it. It make me want to want to punch it made me want to punch the establishment square in that throat really pisses me off and people are people there you know people from a certain generation are you know solid brainwashed like no matter what they hear or see witness i mean solid brainwashed my parents included but i'm glad I, no i'm not glad my parents are brainwashed but seeing as how my parents are not in a legal state i'm glad that they are brainwashed because i don't want because when you can risk your freedom trying to save somebody's life. How crazy does that sound? I'm risking my life to save your life. I'm risking my freedom, my very freedom in this country called Trump America. I guess technically if you're a colored person, you're, you're risking your life then. If you're risking, risking your freedom, then you're damn well risking your life because if you lose your freedom, if you are, uh, if you are detained for no matter how minor, for nothing, let's say nothing. Leaf Browder, rest in peace. Let's say you're detained for nothing. You can still lose your life. Namaste. Yeah, so I didn't mean to get, I didn't mean to get off on a tangent, but anyway. Yeah, so I should have went. It's okay. This ain't my neck of the woods, and I ain't playing no games. Cause this is Trump America now. They make America great again. And I'm not trying to be a victim of that. Of the great, of the re-greatness of America. If your girl starts acting up, then you take a friend. All right. Did this fucker. I don't know if you heard him hit the gas. He revved up after he pulled in front of me. I have not had anybody pull that tightly in front of me in literally years and now we got construction where he's supposed to go slow let's see what his version of slow is see he can't go slow because if he goes slow it'll make him look bad for having pulled out in front of me and we don't want privilege to look enti as entitled as they actually literally are right of course not and that's where you were going. You were right there. You were right there. You endangered yours and every, everyone else and your own life to get one eighth of a mile down the road. Okay. One block. Literally. One block, bro. 
And by bro, I mean the opposite of bro, because you are no brother of mine. I mean, depending on which birth certificate you use, because I understand that certificates of all levels um, qualify you to do what, like, literally whatever you want. So, you might be my brother according to what's convenient for you at a, a certain, under certain circumstances at a certain time. Who asked you? Who asked you? A-S-S-E-D. Who asked you? Ain't nobody asked you. X or asked. Pick one. Don't ask me shit. Don't ask me for shit. But you can X and you can ask. Parking spot waiting just for me. This bitch is really thinking, thinking she gonna take it, but she got another motherfucking thing coming. Bitch. Yeah, that's right. I backed into that bitch. was already on fleet but it's staying lit it's staying lit in trump america staying lit i bet you're like oh i didn't know i didn't know you were going in that parking spot i don't care bitch we're not giving no passes no more i don't care what you thought i don't care if that's what you thought